Pats. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside famed cornerman and broadcast analyst Teddy Allen. Here we go, round number one, scheduled for six. This is the kind of fighter who puts butts in the seats, Teddy. Lights out's got one punch power. He's dynamic. He reminds me of my school teacher, and I hated that guy. He had that eraser, and he could get rid of everything immediately. Come on, I see this. Super two punch combo by Lights Out. Carter's scouting report is an easy one to read. Three letters, J A B. Yes, sir. And that's exactly what he's doing. He's jabbing right, in his way, and I don't up, mean talking. Yeah, I mean throwing that stiff lead hand out into his opponent's face all night long. Watch that punch. He did not see that right hand at all. He may want to tie up. Look at that combination. Five lights out. How critical is it, Teddy? How important is it that when you have a straight right hand like the fighter we're seeing here tonight, that you know how to set the table with that jab? Yeah, Joe, that jab is a table setter. It's a fork that allows you to eat. Otherwise, you get food all over your hands. Good step back, counter punch there. Beautiful. Good block there by Lights Out. Carter's landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. One, two. One, two. He's working the body. He missed with that headshot. We count down the final moments of this round. Jabbing a straight by lights out. And we come to the end of round number one. I can't imagine that he's not going to look to change this here. I mean, early on, all we've seen is him getting hit by headshot after headshot from long range. Well, he's got to start moving that head a little bit. I mean, there's three lines of defense, Joe. Either you use your legs, you move your head, or you block. He's got to use one of them. Lights out just being very hesitant right now offensively. His first thought since being stunned in this fight is protect myself, protect myself. It's like he's turned the off switch on his offense. Yeah, but you can't do that. The lights go off, it gets all dark there. You have to find a way to still have that light on. You know, find the window, find the window of opportunity somewhere. They are out there, be creative. He comes back with the left hand again. He scored well after being hit himself. Keep moving. Keep moving. There you go. There you go. Good double enough for the jab by Lights Out. There's a taste of the sweet science. You see the skill he has in counter punching. And you know what he's doing? He's taking his opponent's jab away. Good two punch combo by Lights Out. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. And that's what fighters do. Pulls the trigger right away after taking one. Oh, a nice two-punch combo by Lights Out. Lights Out's movement's really helping him out, avoiding that punch. Finish with the hook. Finish with the hook. Yeah. Carter's getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. Lights out's at his best when the combinations are landing. He scored well there with that combo. Carries that punch away. Three minutes gone by in this round. Carter's performance tonight has to please all of his backers. He has been scoring from the outside. That was the game plan coming in. He understood from the beginning that he had that great wingspan, that great advantage of length, and he's using it. Clean okay. shot, hey, returning fire. Well done by Carter. And he engages in the clinch. Back to the body, back to the body. 
Yes. Left hook, right hand, well done, especially to the body. Well, I don't know if he's hip to the idea of becoming a counter puncher, but I get the sense you'd agree with it. Yeah, definitely. I mean, he's got the perfect platform, the perfect form for it. The guy's walking in right now, not moving his head much. He can time him, he can counter him. Very nice work there. Jab, uppercut. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Carter. Resourceful one-two combo by Lights Out. Halfway through this round. Left and right. Left and right. That's the ring. Working on at the gym. Good job. Very boy. precise job. double jab by Lights Out. Comes right back with a shot of his own. Carter's putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Do that again. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Teddy, is anything going to change at this point? He keeps getting hit by right hands. Probably not. Let's be honest, Joe. This is a habit. This is a flaw that was with him in the gym, and it's still with him now. It's not going to change. All night long, baby. All night. This is your fight. You are in control. No He's been on target with his attack. Good, accurate punching as we begin round number four here. And he's up three to zip on your scorecard, Teddy. Good counter punching. And when you're counter punching the right way, you're usually getting clean shots. He's getting them. Lights out, picking up right where he left off. Remember how he finished that last round? Yeah, he really finished strong, really fast. And you know what? This is a thinking man's fight. I know a lot of people are going to say Teddy's just an aggressive fighter. No, he understands in his corner, understands that his opponent only had 60 seconds to recover, and they're jumping on him, figuring that the opponent hasn't recovered. There's the combo to the body. Something's got to stick. He sends the combination to the body. Teddy, I'm looking at him right now. He looks completely gassed. Is there anything that can be done to boost his energy back up? Yeah, what you got to do is you got to tell him in the corner, listen, you think you're dead now, you think you're tired now, you're going to have a chance to rest later, but you're not going to have a chance to fix your future. You're not going to have a chance to undo what you're letting be done now. Find the energy. Carter's doing exactly what you should to be a strong defensive fighter. You gotta block those punches away. Lights out, putting on a show here. Defensively putting on a show. And it's helping his offense because, you know, he's creating holes, he's creating opportunities, holes that he's throwing as he makes his opponent miss. Wow, look at that, trading shots. Back to the head he goes. He is not in good shape. He could be on awesome. big shot. He goes down. Oh, he may be close here. One, two, three, four, five. He gets up after that punch put him down on the canvas. Now he needs to get on that bike. Oh, boy, what a break he just caught. The bell rings at the end of the round, saved by the bell. And if you're in the corner, what do you do? Well, you just finished painting the house, you know, and you want to paint a little more, but the paint is still wet. You got to wait for it to dry a little bit. Come on, you got to wait for your guy to wake up. You got to wait for the cobwebs to go away before you can do more painting. Combination to the head. Took a shot, now he gives a left. Oh, that's good stuff. 
Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by Lights Out. Carter's making for a very, very difficult night for his opponent.